All right, we got a no cooling call here. Uh, this is a recommendation from a neighbor. We have not been to this house before. Let's take a look at what they got and see what's going on. Uh, it's a lot older than you. Oh, no. It's a lot older than you are. Let's see if we got any plate on it anywhere. looking at that coil I'm really surprised it's got a lot of refrigerant in it I see it shaking like it's trying to start head pressure looks like it went up a bit when it did that now it's coming back down So I'm actually going to take a look inside of it. Normally I see a unit like this, I just walk away, but maybe put a little Freon in it, but I'm actually going to take a look and see maybe what might be going on here. I'm impressed that it's uh, holding refrigerant, that's for sure. Compressor is hot as a firecracker. And look at that capacitor. <laughs> Hard to believe we may actually get this old girl to fire back up Push one of big old caps here that have knocked the fire out of you Look at that big old thing. And it's only 35 UF. Thirty-five point four. That's strange. So I guess the four is now, or whatever motor they've put in it, is now over there. Look at those U bins. Looking for something to jump out of here and just bite me any second now. I just can't believe it's holding refrigerant after looking at all of that. But it is. Let's 
So I don't think that's 35.4. Thirty-five by four, so thirty-five compressor and a four fan. That's what I'm gonna assume that is. This thing is big and heavy and busted and full of PCBs. Whatever it is, it kills fish and probably kills me too. So let's just take a thirty-five and stick on there. See if it fires up. We're probably going to have to cool it down because she's hot as a firecracker. Come on, do something a little different. Look at that old contactor. I don't know what that is, but it is disabled to say the least. Back in the good old days. Believe it or not, she fired right up. A little bit high on head pressure, a little bit high on suction. Massively hot air coming out of it. Well, let's figure out a way to mount this thing. <laughs> And, uh, yeah, we can say we've done something today. Okay. Pressures are a little high, but this compressor is actually cooled back down and everything. I mean, you couldn't hold your hand right there before it was running so we got to figure out a way to mount this thing this 35 here and uh, we should be good to go I explained in a very few words when you told what, what 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 language was that uh, Cantonese Cantonese Chinese the dialect of Chinese I don't know how to talk that it's okay not many people do. It's a dying dialect. What was what? You didn't tell her that old hippie's crazy. <laughs> you, you sure you didn't say? There's actually no equivalent word for hippie. So you, you, if I said the word hippie, you would hear it. I would. Yeah. Well, there's no there's no word for hippie. Oh, so in, there's in no word in your life, so you yeah. would actually say. So I would actually say hippie. You'd be like, yeah, I, I hear could say you. crazy in Chinese, but hippie, no, you would not know. How you hippie. say crazy in Chinese? Too uh, Tea seed? Tea seed. Tea seed. It's kind of like loco. Yeah. yeah. Gringo loco. Gringo loco. Hippie Gringo loco. loco. Hippie, Hippie loco. loco. Hippie loco. Well, the loco hippie got it running, so. Okay. It's a little bit high pressure. She's at the end of her life, but it's running. Okay. So you should be happy. You want to be on YouTube? No. Wave hello. Hello, YouTube. <laughs>
And the, the lady, the lady's scared of snakes. You scared of snakes? Yeah. <laughs> no, I don't know. I didn't see any snakes. We're okay.